Hello, Earth citizens. In this video, I will show you a 10 minute routine to do for opening your bladder meridian. So if you have bladder issues, because your bladder is not somewhere you can totally just touch and massage and access right away, we use the wisdom of meridian channels, which are energy pathways that are in your body in which energy flows. So your bladder meridian in particular is located on the back of your knee, back of your leg. So it goes down the back side of your body and runs along the back of your legs. So we're gonna focus a lot on opening the back side of your body along with the back of your legs because that energy pathway is connected to your bladder meridian. So if you have tightness on the back of your legs, back side of your body, chances are your bladder is tight as well. But if you work one, it opens the other and vice versa. All right, so we will start with straightening our legs. And then from here, first, shake your legs side to side. First, shake your legs side to side, loosening up tension in your legs. Shake, shake, shake. For 10 seconds, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, stop. Next, bring your legs together and now bounce your knees. When you bounce your knees, just let your knees drop and feel the vibration opening up the back side of your legs. Your toes are pointed up, so don't relax your toes. Toes are pointed up and then bounce. You'll feel a difference. You'll feel a difference on how it affects the back side of your legs. So bounce here. Let's bounce here for 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's go for 10 more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, stop. Now, relax your ankles and shake your legs side to side one more time. And stop. Now, when you inhale, you're going to point your toes in as you inhale. Feel the stretch on the back side of your legs. Feel the pull, especially in your calves. And when you exhale, you're gonna point your toes forward. Shh. So you feel it on the top side of your legs. Inhale. Feel it on the back side. You can feel it to your calves and sometimes to your hamstrings too. Exhale. Let's do three more. Inhale. Feel the back side of your legs. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. Last one. Inhale. Exhale. Great job. Return. Shake your legs. Shake the tension off. Okay, stop. Now legs together and try to touch your toes. If not, ankles, knees, thighs, wherever is okay. But from here, take two steps back with your butt. So one, two. So you stretch your backside a little bit more. And now from here, straighten your spine. Bring your arms straight in front of you. And then now gently push from your lower back. So you're not pushing from your shoulders. Imagine my hands are right on your lower back and I'm pushing you like this. So have that kind of feeling. All right, so arms forward and push from your lower back like this. You should feel a deep stretch on the back side. Keep your toes up. Bouncing here. Let's bounce 30 times. If you feel it in your calves, hamstrings, you're doing great. Ready? One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four. Feel the back side of your legs, your bladder meridians opening. Seven, eight, nine, twenty. Ten more. One, two, three. Push from your lower back. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty. Great job. Now touch your toes if you can. Ankles if you cannot. Knees, thighs is even okay too. Now from here, drop your head, round your shoulders, round your upper back. And here too, gently bounce here. Now feel it more in your shoulders, like you're stretching your spine. Dropping your head, 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, slowly roll your spine back up. <sighs> now we're gonna do the same thing but a different variation. So the basic posture is again pull your toes in so you stretch the back side of your legs and now straighten your spine, palms facing up. Breathe in. As you exhale, bend your upper body forward. Pull your toes up as much as you can. If you can hold your feet, that's great. Feel the stretch on the back side of your legs. Relax your legs. Stay here. Inhale in through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. As you exhale, try to bend a little bit more. Inhale. Exhale, bend a little bit more. One more time, inhale, exhale out through your mouth, bend a little bit more. Great job, inhale. As you exhale, roll your spine up, one vertebrae at a time, letting your head come off last. Good. Now, arms forward again, toes pointed in. And again, push from your lower back only. Lower back, push from your lower back. You'll feel a deep stretch on the back of your legs. Let's bounce here 30 times. One, two, three. It's not a big movement, but you feel a huge stretch if you do it right. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, breathe out, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Ten 20, 10 more, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 30, great job, return. Ooh. If you feel some pain in your shoulders and neck, shake your head side to side, shaking down to your spine, ease tension from your spine. <sighs> great job. And now lie down and first hug the back of your thighs, rock side to side, loosening up your lower back. You did a great job. To finish this routine, we're gonna do a plow pose. So if you're not familiar with a plow pose, what you do is, okay, first stop rocking your lower back. You're going to bring your legs up over your head and try to touch the floor with your toes. So it looks like this. like this but I realize that this is not an easy posture so we're gonna do a modification just so that you can open your bladder meridian a little bit easier 
So what you're gonna do is you're gonna swing your legs back, except stay here, hold, hold yourself in place like this by holding your lower back. And now the key thing here is you pull your toes in. When you pull your toes in, you can feel the back of your legs stretching. When your toes are pointed out, you can feel the back of your legs not stretching. So pull your toes in so they're facing the ground. If you can feel the back of your legs stretching, you're doing it right. So in this posture, relax your shoulders, relax your chest, relax even your hips. And let's hold it here for 30 seconds. Keep pushing your toes towards the ground, pulling your toes in. Relax your whole body. With each exhale, if you can go a little bit further down, that's great. But keep your toes always pointed towards you, pointed in. 30 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Breathe. One, two, three, four, five. If your legs are shaking, that means blockages are opening. Six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine thirty great job now slowly bring your legs down slowly feet on the floor and now turn your body to the left side and also slowly push yourself up back into a seated half lotus posture rest your hands on your knees straighten your spine feel your body how do you feel do you feel like your lower back all the way down the back side of your legs got a nice stretch so that is the real key part of where the bladder meridian is it's on the back side of your body but it's very effective to open the back side of your legs to open your bladder meridian if you have bladder issues this is a very good routine to do every single day so you can stretch and release tension from your bladder you did a great job to experience a full one-hour brain education-based class, please visit a local body of brain yoga studio near you.